60 days Lusaka water shutdown ends with more water added to supply capacity. Following the shutdown of the main supply pipeline and deactivation of the Lolanda 1 facility in Kafue on 14th September, the shutdown has come to an end as there is more water supply capacity after the successful repair of the main pipeline and the reactivation of Lolanda 1 facility. Kamala Ward Councillor Mainda Smata says the first 120,000 cubic meters supply of water reached Lusaka's Liwala Waters Reservoirs on Saturday and a close observation of the pipe by engineers shows no leakage. The one which is the main uh, treatment plant in Kathiowe is now back online and is supplying a maximum of 120,000 cubic meters of water to Lusaka daily. Previously, because of the leakage, they had lost uh, about uh, 20,000 cubic meters supply of water, which necessitated the agent repair works, because if that had continued, it means more and more water would be would have been lost, and uh, resources used to treat this water would also be lost in the process. He adds that the estimated 20,000 cubic meters which was being lost daily is now added back to the supply capacity. So the works have been done. Engineers have confirmed that the pipe is holding fast. All pressure tests have been done. And the first uh, bad supply of 120,000 cubic meters reached to suck as Liberal Water Weeks yesterday. So I'd like to thank uh, all the residents and all the people that were affected by this uh, water uh, crisis for their patience and endurance. So those who do not receive water even up to now, as we are speaking, should contact Lusaka uh, Water. They are going to send their engineers on site just to tweak systems here and there to ensure that all networks are open and supply is being uh, on 13th September 2023, Minister of Water Development and Sanitation, Mike Mposha, announced that there was going to be a water interruption in Lusaka so as to facilitate the repair works at Lolanda Water Treatment Plant. Vanessa Chibwe, Movie TV News.